Hi, this is Keith with PharmacyTechStudy.com, and this video is about question three on quiz two, and it asks, what concentration of sodium chloride solution would be hypertonic? And you may have already learned about this in your program, but you forgot, or maybe you just haven't learned about it just yet, and so I wanted to give a quick and dirty explanation since I get a lot of emails asking what I'm even talking about with this question. So. I draw out this little grid and over here in this column this represents how much sodium chloride percentage in a solution is and here in the middle I have 0.9 percent and what that is is that is an isotonic solution of sodium chloride and what that means is uh, let's break it down. ISO is an abbreviation which means International Standard of Osmolarity and tonic means it's a medication that restores the body and so what that means um, the International Standard of Osmolarity in this case is the percentage of sodium chloride in a solution that would be um, friendly with the same amount that's in our natural bloodstream and so that's where we get the 0.9%. Okay, so now anything above that would be hypertonic. Okay, and as you know, the word hyper means above or over. And then anything below that would be hypotonic. And the word hypo means below or beneath or lower than. And so that's a quick and dirty explanation of what we're looking for in this question um, and so this is what you're going to need to remember pretty much it's easy you just remember that isotonic is 0.9 percent it's just barely less than one percent in a sodium chloride solution to be isotonic and so once you remember that and you know that hypo means over and hypo means under um, when you are faced with this question then you can look at the different answers and what's available and you can see that D at 9% would definitely be hypertonic. So the answer is D, 9% uh, is a hypertonic solution, whereas the rest are either isotonic or hypotonic.